It's now been over two weeks since any type of 0.41 dropped, and in that time I only made a brief community post about it. I think it's high time we sit down and unpack this one. AnyType Update 0.41.0 came out on June 10th, 2024. For the sake of efficiency, I'll refer to it here just as AnyType 41. Now, the main feature touted in this update is the batch relation editing, which lets you edit multiple relations at once. If you have a lot of objects in a set or collection, you can just highlight them, right click, click edit relations. And then from here, you can choose which relations to add or get rid of. This could be pretty helpful if you wanted to make some quick categorization without editing each of the individual objects. Now, the second main feature, and what I'm personally happy about, is the improved search. Any type search was pretty bad since its inception, but we finally used 100% of the human brain to bring us an updated search bar. Now, searching for a term can show the precise context of where it is. For instance, if I search the word question, I'm shown every note where it's used, as well as the surrounding context. This makes search actually do what it says, that is, search. Very useful and a feature that I think everyone will appreciate being changed. AnyType has also given us the ability to choose existing files for embeds. Now, if you type slash and then type picture, you can right click on this block to add an existing file. I think this is a little clunky, I think it would make more sense to have the box be a search bar for the title of the desired image, but at least it's easier than trying to just add an object and then search for the file in the list of every object. And naturally, this works for videos and other media types as well as pictures. Finally, you can now change the default style for links to be cards instead of just underlined text. This can be changed in the Preferences tab if you prefer the old way. And the library now has a sorting feature. This obviously lets you change how you view and how you sort your types and relations. Now, honestly, this update is pretty small, and I probably should have made this video sooner. There was an online AnyType meeting a couple days ago, so I'll watch that and report on any future plans that they announce. I get the feeling that AnyType is preparing for some big updates this year. Now that we have online sharing, I think they're pushing closer to a full release, so sit tight and hang around the channel if you want to get the news sent straight to you.